All right, as promised, we're gonna bring you guys along as we get the RV ready for uh, for Baja. We're at Napa Auto Parts. We're gonna get all the filters and fluids we need for the RV and the generator. So air filters, air dryers, oil filters, fuel filters, fuel water separators, all kinds of crap. So let's go get it, spend some money. I've got everything over here ready. As you can see, Onan 7500 quiet diesel. These are pretty common. First off, the RV geeks have really awesome videos all about servicing this exact same unit. So with that said, go check them out and see their videos. Uh, I figured though, since I'm doing this, this is one of the things we're doing to get our RV ready for Baja, Mexico. Uh, I'm going to show you what I have down here. We'll be doing the air filter, the fuel filter, and the oil filter. The fuel filter is only serviced every five years, but because we don't know the, the history of this one, we're just going to do it today anyways. warm up we have to get the oil out of there that's still the old oil by warming it up we'll make the oil more more viscous more fluid it's also good if you can put a load on the unit to get it extra heat it up and run it for a little while and shut it down do something <laughs> I need a camera <laughs> I need a camera holder that doesn't talk to me it's not budging it's in there really really tight it's not just it's dripping so we're gonna drop that. Instead, we're gonna take this guy and this guy. Okay. Oh, that's right. Oh, holy shit. Where's this damn thing? It really just. Oh, so much. Oh. camera holder is also my beautiful tool, babe. Mm -hmm. I need a 7 over 16, please. I know what a 7 16th is. You can just, you can say the, oh my god. 7 Jesse. backslash 16. And actually, no. If you were on a computer, <laughs> it would be 7 backslash 16. You, the phone will hit your face here in just a minute. <laughs> Good job, that's the right side. Mm -hmm. ah. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> what, I'm at, what I'm after is this right here. That's a few more leverage. This is three eighths. Yep. This is half inch. Yep. We'll be we'll be at one inch here in a minute. <laughs> So now we need to put the generator under load and run it for a while and blow all the soot out. While that's happening, we'll, I'll also be underneath the unit checking for any leaks.
found a fuel leak, but that's been fixed and we're ready to go to the next step. So now we need to put the generator under a load for a few minutes and go ahead and blow out any backed up or built up carbon. Then we'll let her cool off, shut her down and finish the service. Generator, in order to clean out all the soot, needs to be under load.